The Mr. Shell gifted perfect chance to begin. 49 million pounds link out price Burnley raid amid Sean Disher seeking. A blanket of uncertainty has been thrown over Burnley Football Club following the sacking of Sean Disher. The club has sacked the 50 year old after nine and a half years playing Cheshire side. The decision comes aiming at a relegation battle that sees the Clarets for points from safety behind Franklin and Pots Everton. Should Burnley find themselves relegated to the Championship at the end of the season, they could naturally be harvested for some of their leading talent. Jake Stokes, Wout Workhorst If Chelsea does have the chance to poach a player or two from Burnley at the end of the season, then I'd set my sights on Wout Workhorst. Though Dwight McNeil and Maxwell Cornerberg might interest, I think that the 29-year-old striker could offer something new to the Mr. Shell side. The Blues obviously lost Olivier Giroud in the summer, and I think the six-foot, six Dutchman could emulate his success with horses, no slouch either. He's a proven serial goal scorer, and off the bench, he'd strike fair into defenders. He has the potential to be a top, top option, and he's only valued at 15.3 million pounds by transfer market. Anita Bayomi, Nick Pope. It seems that Kappa Ariza Balaga could be on his way out this summer. It would be a say goodbye, but it's time for a new contender to challenge Edward Mendy to be that first choice goalkeeper. The English international has proven reliable in the past, despite being let down on several occasions by his defence in front of him. Luckily, Chelsea can offer him a solid back line, and it could be a chance for him to get back into the England squad. He was once named amongst the likes of Jordan Pickford and Aaron. However, since his injury, Ramsdale had been placed behind West Brom's Sam Johnstone. It's a bit of stretch and more of a selfish pick from me. If he does choose to leave, the 29-year-old will want to be the first choice, not fighting for it. Pope has just over 14 months on his contract and it will be very hard for Burnley to sign him up to a long-term deal if they are relegated. Scott Clayton, James Tarkovsky We all know Chelsea fans will be reading this and think Burnley. Why should we want someone from Burnley? We are Champions League and Club World Cup holders and we don't need any potential relegated players. I do remember fans turning names up at Garage. Cahill and Nicholas Analka when signed from Bolton at them years ago. With the takeover currently happening, I expect the new owners will have the bigger and greater marquee signings on the list ahead of these players we have picked. But you are still walking into a summer where we could lose Andres Christensen and Antonio Rudiger for free. So a cheap sold an experienced defender that knows the Premier League is under the worst shout. We don't expect any of these deals to happen, but these three big Saudis and players in their own right, as they've shown time and time again over the years as Chelsea battled to get three points against them. Just like Cahill deal and him only having six points on his contract, so he got him for a much lower fee. Tarkovsky has less than two months on his current deal and getting in a cheap, reliable defender on a free is worthy candidate to throw into the mix. All three of our picks are valuation that add up to thirty nine million pounds link on transfer market and if we could possibly get them for way less than that then it would be a bargain.